We are getting into the heat of winners finals right now. It's gonna be. Did these guys play last week in Brands? I don't remember. How do you not remember? Weren't you there? It's all a blur. I haven't seen my kids in months. Yeah. All right, winners finals. Let's get into this. So they're starting off on Smashville. Uh, pretty ooh. ooh, yucky. All right, I was saying before how Mr. E has been playing really well today, and that is just another showcase of him doing so. He's already taken out Sinji. He beat Frozen. He's, He's dead. dead. Did he? He might be playing good today, but Venny has been playing well all month. That's a fact. I was, I could say like his whole life, but yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was like one weekly where he went like, didn't get top eight. Maybe, I don't know. Regardless, Mr. E is still, that's so cool. Sorry, Mr. E is still doing, a, if he died again, if he died again in the exact same way. Uh, uh. He's going for a lot of these down airs, interestingly enough. Okay. Then he is definitely trying to be more sneaky with his movement, but he is not really falling for much. Yeah. He hasn't really, definitely Benny's movement has prevented him from getting killed. At I've, the same time. I yeah. feel like this is kind of like a new E. Like the past few weeks or just like watching him and play in general, I feel like there's been a lot of like calculated positioning in how he's been playing. I, I, I feel like our the counter. baby I, boy isn't mashing anymore. That I, counter. No, no, I just, yes. you know the funny thing? In my head, I was like, oh, this feels like a counter position. Yeah. But like no good. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. You gotta like you throw it out only once in a while, and like he did it when like he knew his opponent was desperate for a kill. Not only was he desperate for the kill, but also Benny had done a really good job of limiting his options. Yeah. And like <gasps> the sort of thing where like Ooh. he drifted him into this position where Benny probably would have felt pretty cool about getting a forward smash, but he's like, I got a counter. Oh, he actually reading that roll and able to do even more damage. A grab to down throw. I want to follow through right there. 94% already done on Venia. And uh, Mr. E has uh. been pretty dang consistent about killing, at least so far in this set. Another one, uh, uh, well, maybe not another one of those, but like a few more. And that'll end up being a kill. Well, but let's Ooh. not forget about the combo potential that Venia has. Oh, yes. One so oh, wow. All right, I respect it. Uh, going for the up B, didn't want to like over, didn't want to commit to something that could end horrendously wrong. So even though we got the wonky hitbox on it, uh, you know, whatever. Yep, going for it again. He's just like, yeah. Because, like, go for that situation, and, like, eventually that'll be unteckable. Oh, boy. Every time that he lets Venya back is a potential for Venya to, to come back. He's Mr. He's going for a lot of these full hops, though, and already Venya is starting to recognize it. But that's the thing about it is that, like, Venya, sorry, Mr. E was doing all these full hops, kind of like not just bursting through. And that rolled uh, Venya into a false sense of security, and that's why he was able to go in and get that dash attack. So not see. the dash attack, sorry, the pivot F tilt. Mm hmm. Like, if you look at it, I'm pretty sure, if you look at that replay, I don't think he was in lag. The last kill? The last kill, yeah. I don't think he was in lag still. I think he just, like, didn't move there because he didn't think that he was going to, uh... Yeah, yeah he just stood there and he took it. He just stood there because he was confident that he was going to, like, do another phone up or something like that. Wasn't actually prepared for that follow-through. Yeah, I mean, that, that just because that kind of bit him back, I, that's still one of the things that's, like, really great about Venya's play is that like oh yeah he's doing a lot more of it yeah but he's just he, observing you know? yeah he's observing and also he's like standing still like of course his movement is amazing one of the best 
like the way his movement integrates with his play style. He's one of the best at doing so. Uh, but lately, he's also been standing still. He said like a like a real frog does. Real frogs don't catch their prey by dash dancing back and forth. They stand still and then they just, you know. You see those OS frogs in the chat. As they sit perfectly still. Wow, one of those uh, super uh. Oh. Okay. Everyone's okay somehow. Nobody died. That down air, Hurtbox shifted him. That was so clever. Hey, Faze. Mr. E trapped here on the ledge. Another one of those. That's actually the second time where he's like gotten off the ledge and gone for that aggressive like pivot X tilt. So if Benny starts to catch on to that, he might be able to punish it. But. Nonetheless, it's the sort of thing that Mr. E doesn't, he doesn't fall into habit traps hard, you know? Feels like as soon as you have a read on what he's going to do, then he goes for that mix-up. It's one of the things that makes him such a strong player. That's a big, oh, he went for that read and he messed it up just barely. And that ended up being really bad for E. He no longer has that stock lead to fall back on. And yes, he mentioned to you about 30% extra credit, but one combo from Venio will set him all the way back to being on the losing side of this game. We've seen Venio do so much worse. Look at these guys, they're just dancing around each other. Absolutely respecting what the other player is capable of. Oh, and now maybe that knowledge of those defensive habits is starting to come through for Venia. Ooh. <gasps> That's really bad. Oh, he went, went so far out there. Ooh, I think the water saved him. Or helped. I I don't rightly know. He's still on yeah, a jump, so. I'm not super sure either. I, at least it did a couple percent, so it was worth it. Down in the forward air, not enough to close out the stock, but E is now sitting at 122%. That is not a great place to be in against a Greninja, especially one like Venia. He's starting to go for those more aggressive follow throughs, but not able to actually convert off of it. And that means that. Oh, 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 oh he's dead. He's gone. Yeah. Yeah, great job from Benny. Doesn't want to bother with the drift that uh, Mr. E might do, so he just goes up to me. Oh my god. He's just like, yeah, charge that shuriken, idiot. <laughs> he just goes right off. He's like, you gonna do it again, dummy? Alright, now I'm gonna hit you for it. <laughs> that was so brash. Alright, Venia, this is FD, so one of the better stages for Venia to get his combos on. But it feels that they weren't really working out for him at the beginning of this set. But now they're getting much more consistent. Wow, that that, that was so beautiful. Did he do A landing into dash attack right there? I missed it. Uh, where he was like, you know, being hit away. He was in tumble and then he landed on the ground and immediately did dash attack. I clipped it. Take a look. If maybe I caught it. Yeah, I think he did. Yeah. We'll, we'll take a look at it afterwards. But right now, these guys are neck Ooh. and neck. Absolutely. Ooh. This game could go either way. Another grab from Mr. E. Beautiful air dodge from Venia. He does have those he really hard hitting moves, though. He expected the Nair to hit him the other way. <clears throat> oh, he gets the tech, though. Amazing punishes with the back air. Fantastic stuff from Mr. E. That happened earlier. He went for that up B and Benny attacked it and managed to get back to stage. That time he was so ready for it and he punishes with a back air to convert into a kill. Just beautiful stuff from Mr. E. He is earning his spot oh, in Grand Finals, winner's side. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Can we take a look at the other clip though? Uh, let or me is it gone to the history of time? This one. This one. See, right? Wasn't he? I think that must have been an A landing into dash attack, because he was in tumble. 
and then he, yeah, he A landed with forward air and then immediately dash attack. That's so smart. Yep, yeah, you're right. You're 100% right. All right, cool.